Kirsten. Taking a look ahead now, a statewide program called a OK to Grow is helping high schoolers get a head start on their career. Well, they're having a fundraiser on Tuesday, and Stephanie Cameron is the state director of OK to Grow, and Tom Triplett from Tulsa Tech is here joining me today. So thanks for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having us. Thank you. Well, Be first. Here. First up, can you tell us what OK to Grow is exactly? Yeah, so OK to Grow is a workforce development and career pathways nonprofit. We help students understand the opportunities available in our community. Okay, and what are the three initiatives you guys work on all year? So we work on youth entrepreneurship, high school completion activities, and career awareness. We're doing things like student and educator tours of local businesses, career pathways, fairs, and internships. Okay, and Tulsa Tech is one of the group's biggest sponsors. How did they help with workforce development? Well, workforce development is talent development, and they do a, a great job of making students aware of the environments that uh, they will be seeing in the workplace and the expectations of the employer. So workforce development is talent development, is economic development. Very important. It and is. you guys are having your big event on Tuesday, the Red Bud Lip Sync Battle. Can you tell yes. us a little bit about that? Yeah, so it's going to be a lot of fun. We have five teams vying to be the Lip Sync Champion for 2017. We are going to have some fun drawings. We have some American Airlines miles. Um, it's going to be a lot of fun with a wine pull. Tickets are $40 and available, and Tom is participating on one of our Lip Sync are teams. Are you? <laughs> we, uh, we have a new routine this year. We didn't quite win <laughs> last year, but we've got some special sauce this year we think is going to be effective. What, gonna... what song are you guys doing, or is it a surprise? It's a, it's a medley, and that's as far as I'm <laughs> going to go. Well, <laughs> I'm going to tell you, our reporter Giselle Puente is participating, and she is a, this will be her second time, and our partners, uh, radio partners, K Hits people are, and I hear they're pretty good, and that, is that a picture of Giselle dancing? I think so. uh, that looks that looks like a rodeo dance. So <laughs> that is your competition to try to beat that. So that's just a little tease of what they're going to bring on Tuesday for you guys. All right. Well, again, that event is Tuesday from 5:30 to 7:30 at the IDL Ballroom. Tickets are forty dollars. Thanks for joining us, guys. Thank you. Thanks. And we can't wait to see more of Jitzel's dance moves like that. <laughs> All right. Still ahead.